Mom, I'm too hot. Mom, does this freaking happen to you? When this moment happens, I lose it. I'm like, are you kidding me? I am done. I am done, done, done. I have helped you all day long. I made your lunch. I got you from school. I did this. We got our bedtime. Like, please just let me have my time to go watch my show and have a minute with my husband. It's so aggravating. You can just be like, no, I am not doing this for you anymore. These are moments where I lose my marbles at my kids. I'll throw stuff and I'm like, no, I'm not. I'm not doing that for you. I am done. I'm over it. That's it. I have done too many things and I'm done. And then I feel so bad. You guys, can we make a pact? Can we agree that we don't have to feel bad? We don't have to get to the brink where we're like over it and yelling and screaming and like, ah, and saying things to them like, I'm done with you. Like I end up saying, let's make a pact that it's okay to set a boundary and say, I'm going to do this many more things. This is our bedtime and that's it. Mommy deserves her time. Mommy and daddy deserve time together. Or if daddy's doing bedtime, he deserves his time. And you need to go to sleep. My friends, it is time. Bedtime can be different. I want to empower you today. If you're getting to the edge of your rope, shorten your freaking rope. I want to give you permission. Because it's so easy to get so mad. Yeah, I see people connecting, saying, yes, I feel that way too. Like, I just like want to strangle you because I need this time to myself. Quit asking me for stuff. But wait a minute, you guys. We're the grownups. You can set a boundary. I give you full permission. You are not being a mean mom. You are not going to cause attachment problems. You are not abandoning them. You are taking care of yourself and your family. It's okay to set boundaries at bedtime. Let's do this together.